In case you guys missed the last vlog, I flew by myself across the country to visit the East Coast and my cousin Brittany. I saw fall foliage for the first time, lots of farm animals, visited Salem, Massachusetts, and felt like I was living a real life Gilmore Girls episode. Make sure to go watch the last vlog before you watch this one, and if you have, hope you enjoy. I know like this is hangout like gear for you, <laughs> but, but it's not for us. Good morning, guys. So we currently just got coffee at Wicked Good Coffee and I haven't tried it yet. We'll do a taste test. I think people can tell I'm not from here because I walked in in this furry jacket situation and she, yeah, it's a shirt jacket. I don't know, poncho? I don't even know what you would call it. She was looking at my fur. I think she knew I wasn't from here, but we're just gonna pretend that that didn't happen. But we're trying Wicked Good Coffee. I got a blondie brownie, I think. Blondie brownie. Blondie brownie. Blondie brownie. I've never. Dessert. Really? I've never had a blondie brownie before. No, I haven't now had a I lot like of I have things to make here. These for you. While we're here, I literally, Brittany just keeps talking about certain foods, and I'm like, yeah, I've never had that. I don't even know what that is. Okay, we're gonna try it. <laughs> it smells good. <gasps> it's working good. Mm. I used to say my favorite coffee was in Texas. My favorite coffee is here now. We gotta come back here at some point. <laughs> come back all the way back. <laughs> That's delicious. It is now Wednesday and it's currently 1.50. I think it's 12.50. 12.50? I haven't oh. turned my clock back yet. It makes me feel a little bit better. I woke up kind of late because I'm still not adjusted to the sleep schedule, which is so weird because I've almost been here for like a week. Right now we are heading into Boston and we're gonna go to the aquarium and I'm so excited. I have been wanting to go to the aquarium in LA a lot recently, but they're always sold out, so I'm very excited. You can tell that we're cousins because we both say sorry a lot and we both roast each other. We were <laughs> in we were in Wicked Good Coffee and I was debating on what flavor to get because keep in mind they have like 30 different flavors and in LA they usually have only like five. So I was really overwhelmed. I didn't know what to get and I was like I probably shouldn't get pumpkin because I've gotten pumpkin everywhere else and then Brittany says yeah that's because you're basic <laughs> and I'm like I know I'm basic I like being basic okay I have my basic moments when I wear my Brandy Melville and I get my pumpkin spice lattes with my Uggs that's when I'm at my basic prime you aren't even wearing Uggs today I know I'm not wearing my oh, my Uggs would have looked so cute with this <laughs> I was like wait a minute but they were brown oh uh, what an L I just took an L right now that but it's not point. even that like cold out for Uggs either. It's 62. Okay, like, I wear Uggs like in 70. LA True. when it's I was trying to help degrees. you. Okay, never mind. Go back to roasting. Go back to roasting. No. Why don't you wear your Uggs uh, back? Uh, <laughs> uh, I, nation, though, okay, girl. I know. I walked into that one. I walked into it. It's okay. When Gianni comes, we'll start roasting him together. And then we'll be tag team. Wait for Gianni to come. He's actually calling me, so I'm oh. gonna go. I'll see you at the aquarium. downtown Massachusetts. I don't even know where I am to be honest with you right now, but people are scary and aggressive. <laughs> people are driving so aggressively and I'm really confused. I was taking a nap and then all of a sudden I woke up and people were angry and I was like, why? <laughs> Whoa, 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 what happened here? Anywho, we're about to go to the Van Gogh exhibit. I don't know if you've seen it online, but they basically have Van Gogh's paintings on the ceilings and the walls and the floors, and it's gonna be great, what and it's people? cold. Why are they all so <laughs> Brittany's freaking out.
Alrighty. <laughs> Good morning everyone. Literally looks like I am in a freaking green screen right now. So it's now Thursday and if you're wondering where I am, I'm literally just in my cousin's backyard. Their house is like in the woods, so it literally looks like a green screen right now. I just come out here in the morning and vibe. I don't know if you can tell how cold it is. I don't know if like the camera's picking it up, but it's literally like 36 degrees and I'm enjoying every second of it because the second I go to California, I'm going to miss this weather so much. But I thought I would start off the vlog here and tell you guys what we're doing today. So today we are going to Connecticut and Rhode Island. I don't know if I've ever really talked about it in a vlog, but my grandpa and grandma did used to live in Rhode Island. So I do have a lot of family up there and I have visited a few times, but I haven't been since I was like 13. So we're just gonna see a bunch of old places that I used to visit when I was a kid and I'm really excited about that And then we're gonna go to Connecticut and go to the town where Gilmore Girls was inspired by We even might stop by Yale. I don't really know. We're just gonna have a little fun day Lots of road tripping and I can't wait to see you guys along for it. It's freezing But like look, this is like what I was talking about. They literally live in the woods <laughs> This is so pretty. I love this little section right here because all the leaves are changing still. A lot of the trees have died, obviously, because we're now approaching winter. It's like late November now, but it's so pretty here. Oh my God, look at like the sun peeking through. Wow, oh my God. Also, I have to show you all this. Look at how big this skeleton is. I don't know if y'all can tell on camera, but he's literally 12 feet. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> I love New Hampshire. We're currently filling up the car tires so that we can just go straight there and have no issues. I think we're gonna head to Connecticut first because that way we can head to Connecticut and then Rhode Island will be on the way back. So it's gonna be a little road trip. We're definitely gonna have to get some coffee because I am tired and I've been up since 6.30. I'm currently trying to set you up on a car. I think this is the first outfit of the day of the vlog, which is so bizarre, but my sweater is from Aritzia. I love it so much. My jeans are from Amazon, as well as these knee-high socks. They're from Amazon and my boots. So my whole lower half is Amazon, which is crazy. Hmm, what do I want today? I'm gonna start with three large iced coffees. First one's gonna be the, the, the cold, the pumpkin cold brew. Okay guys, so we are now in Connecticut and we are first at the Mayflower Inn. It's right behind me. If you are a big fan of Gilmore Girls, this is where the writer was staying to get the inspiration for Gilmore Girls. So this inspired like the dragonfly and all the inns. And then this is where like she wrote most of the show. So this is the first stop. I'm feeling kind of weird filming here because I don't think I'm supposed to be, but like we're just gonna pretend that it's okay. And look how pretty it is. There's a bunch of trees and stuff. This hotel's really bougie. It's really expensive to stay here at night, but it's really pretty. Good morning, we're going to Cumbies. It's the first time it's raining since I've been here and I finally get to whip out my big, big coat. I'm freezing. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Cumbies is literally the most iconic place in the entire world. It's like a supermarket gas station vibe. If you guys remember my PA vlog, I went to Wawa, it's very similar, but they have such cool stuff.
at Yale and oh my god I wish I was smart enough to go here because this campus is so pretty it's not giving me like exact Gilmore Girls vibes because obviously they didn't film here they probably filmed on like a sound studio but I think it's prettier than the show Okay guys, so it is now one o'clock in the morning. I'm now in my hotel room and I'm about to do a face mask. If you're wondering what I'm doing is this like coconut sheet mask from Sephora. Wow, I'm such a beauty guru. I'm not gonna do like a hotel room tour or anything because Gianni and I are actually gonna check into the same hotel but a different room. Since it's just me, I didn't need anything super crazy but I can't believe I'm about to do this haul like this. This is actually insane. I can't believe I'm filming this haul like this but I wanted to end this vlog by giving you guys a haul of everything I got in Connecticut. I didn't film a haul of what I got in Stars Hollow or Washington, Connecticut and I also got some stuff at Yale today So I thought I would just give you guys a little haul to close up this video So from Washington, I got this little mug and I thought it was super cute Obviously, they drink a ton of coffee in Gilmore Girls So I had to get a coffee cup. This one's actually a tumbler It says Stars Hollow road trip and we did indeed do a big road trip just to visit this town And I wanted one that I could take on the go Well, it was also the only like cup they had but I had to get something coffee related and then I also ended up getting some stickers so this one says no cell phones like the sign in Luke's and then I just got this little Luke's diner logo I got two other ones but I'll show you where they are at the bookstore I got three books you guys know I've talked about it in vlogs I've been super into reading recently and I like getting books when I travel places so I could be like oh I got this one in Connecticut and it just is like a happy memory tied to the book I'm literally gonna take this off because I cannot vlog like this anymore the first book I got is always in December and we are approaching the Christmas season so I wanted to get this and I even put a little stars hollow sticker in there so I can remember that's where I got it And then I got the notebook I've actually been wanting to read this for a while because I love the movie I sobbed like a baby the first time I saw it and sometimes books are better than the movies And I just wanted to read this one and again I put a little sticker this one says the dragonfly in and then lastly I didn't put a sticker in this one just because it will automatically remind me of Salem But I got the crucible so if you don't know this is like a play written about the Salem witch trials and and when we went to the wax museum in Salem, a lot of the characters from the Crucible were in like wax figure form. So I kind of just want to read this so I can know where I visited and know more about the history. And then from Yale, I got this for Gianni. I just got him this Yale hat because it matched the sweatshirt that I got, but I thought it was really cute. I might even steal it from him. And then I got this little white crew neck that says Yale. Obviously, you can get sweaters like this anywhere really. You can get it on Amazon or just anywhere but I wanted to get one actually from Yale so I could say I got it while I was visiting there and I know no one that goes to Yale like I have an Alabama sweatshirt and you know Dante goes there but I wanted to visit Yale because obviously that's where Rory goes in Gilmore Girls and also that was Blair's dream school so a lot of my favorite TV show characters love Yale so I thought it would just be fun to visit and it was really fun it was such a beautiful campus and then last but not least while we were in Connecticut there was this little cute dog store and I got this little sweater for Rose that I thought would be perfect for the Christmas season and as a little deer on it and there are a ton of deers and moose in New Hampshire and Connecticut and everything so I thought it'd be like a fun little thing to get for her but yeah that's everything I got I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog I seriously had the best week it was just so refreshing and it was exactly what I needed I just feel like I'm in such a good headspace and I'm just very grateful to Ken and Brittany thank you so 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 much for letting me stay with you I had so much fun they're the best hosts and I just love them so much and I'm so happy that I got to come out I just want to say a huge thank you to them in this vlog because they did everything in their power to make this the best trip for me and it really was and I'm so excited and the trip is not over yet Gianni actually flies into New York tomorrow morning so he'll be here at 8 30 in the morning and then him and I are gonna have a little week here so that will be the next vlog so make sure you stay tuned it will be another New York vlog I guess 2021 is just the year of New York hopefully 2022 will be as well in 2023 and so on you guys know I love it here please make sure to subscribe so you don't miss that video and every future video i seriously love you guys so much and i'm feeling so inspired for youtube like 
I'm telling you this trip was exactly what I needed I just feel so refreshed and like good and happy and I love you guys so yeah I'm kind of rambling I just wanted to get the point across that I love you I really do and I will see you guys in the next vlog which will be all about New York good night